Hello everyone, Tyler here for MotionArray.com and in this After Effects tutorial I want to show you a quick and easy way to add this glossy look to your logo and do it all on a single layer. Now normally when I would do this effect I would have a couple different uh, instances of my logo, I would have a black solid with a ramp on it, and I would also have an adjustment layer with a light sweep effect on it, all just to achieve this effect but I wanna show you how to do it on one single layer. So let's go ahead and take a look. All right, so here we are in After Effects and I have my logo here and it's scaled down slightly. And the first thing I wanna do is add the solid composite effect to the layer. So I'm just gonna highlight my layer and come up to Effect, come down to Channel and Solid Composite. And basically what this does is just fills in the layer with a solid. So next, I want to apply the ramp effect. So I'm going to come up to Effect, Generate, and come down to Ramp. And basically, that adds a nice gradient to our layer. The next step is to add a transform effect to the layer. So I'm going to highlight it, come up to Effect, Distort, and Transform. Now with this, I would simply want to rotate my layer using the transform effect and I will change the position of it slightly to about there. That looks pretty good. Now the next thing I want to do is add the CC composite effect. So I'm going to come up to effect, channel, and CC composite. Now I want to unclick this RGB only and I want to change this from in front to add. So now we are adding our gradient on top of our original logo. But as you can see, you know, we have our gradient extending beyond our logo. So I want to add another CC composite effect to this layer. So with it highlighted, I'm going to come up to effect and channel and CC composite. And this time I'm going to uncheck the RGB only and I'm going to change this from in front to stencil alpha. And now you can see we're getting this nice glossy look on our logo, but it's a little bright. So I'm going to come into this transform effect and I'm going to bring the opacity down to about uh, 45. That looks pretty good. Somewhere in there. Ah, 46. How about that? Perfect. All right, so now, you know, we have our nice glossy effect, but let's say we want to have it sweep across our logo. I'm just going to come up and set a keyframe here at the, for the position at the beginning of this timeline and move forward and just slide it over. So now we have our glossy effect sweeping across our logo. All right, so the next thing I want to do is add the light sweep effect to my logo. So I'm going to highlight it, come up to Effects, Generate, and CC Light Sweep. Now, I really don't like uh, this effect when it has the light sweep on the center of my logo. So I'm just going to take the sweep intensity down to zero. And I just really want this kind of highlight on the edge. So I'm gonna, I think that's a little thick there for the edge thickness. I'm gonna drop that down to about two. And I wanna increase the width so that it's, you know, hitting more of my logo. And the next thing I wanna do is set a couple of keyframes for the direction of the light sweep. So at the beginning, I'll set a keyframe and then I'll move to the end and just rotate this around to the other side. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we have. This looks pretty good. Um, I think it's pretty much identical to the old way of doing it. And we did it all on one single layer. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you learned something. And thanks for watching.